computed properties are an essential building block for every Vue developer. They allow us to derive values from reactive data, but whenever any of those dependencies change, our computed property will update as well. This is an essential piece of reactivity in Vue, but there's actually a few cases where computed can cause your app to unnecessarily update. So in this quick video, we're going to take a look at how computed works, and then take a look at a case where computed might not be the best tool for the job. But first, I gotta give credit to Torsten, the Vue core team member who actually laid out a lot of these ideas in a blog post. So if you ever want more information, I recommend checking out the article that I'll link down below. To start off, let's take a deeper look at Computed. First, computer properties are cached based on their reactive dependencies. This means that our callback function will only run when a dependency changes. So if we access our computer property multiple times without the dependencies changing, we'll immediately get back the cached result. Most of the time, this is a great optimization because if we have an expensive computer property, with lots of computation, we only want to run it when necessary. And next, computer properties evaluate lazily. This means that our callback will only run when our computed value is actually being read. So for a simple example, let's say we're printing out is count over five only if count is even. Every time we increment count, since a dependency changed, Vue will know that our computed property has to be reevaluated, but it won't reevaluate until it's being read from somewhere, which in this case is when count is even. And once again, for most cases, this is an optimal way to avoid unnecessary updates. But one case where lazy evaluation can hurt our performance is when we have an expensive computation that relies on our computed property. So in our example, let's say we have another computer property called message that prints out goodbye when is count over five is true and hello if it's false. So if we go to our browser, every time we increment count, is count over five is evaluating, but we can also see that message is being evaluated every time, which you may find a little weird because is count over five only changes once when count equals six. And the reason that this is happening is is count over five is being evaluated lazily. So when count changes, we know that is count over five will have to be reevaluated, but that will only happen when the value is read. So right now, we don't know if is count over five is true or false. And since we don't know this, Vue will have to reevaluate message because we don't know if it should change or not. So our message callback runs, and when it reads our computed property, our is count over five callback runs. So while in this case, this will make a big performance difference, if our computed property did a ton of array transfer, transformations, or if we had an expensive watch effect based off is count over five, then this could start causing problems. And in these situations, we can solve this by making is count over five compute eagerly instead of lazily, meaning our callback will run as soon as a dependency changes instead of waiting for it to be read. So in the example, as soon as count changes, is count over five will evaluate. And since we know this value, our watch effect and computed will only run when it changes instead of running all the time. In Torsten's original post, this is achieved by creating a utility that acts like a computed, but uses a watch effect to get immediate updates when a dependency changes. Like computed, it takes a callback function, tracks our computed property with result, and makes updates to result using a watch effect, and making sure that the flush timing is set to sync so our callback is triggered immediately as soon as a dependency changes. And then to be similar to a computed property, returns a read-only version of our result. You can implement this as a helper in your own code, or this is available in view use by importing computed eager. So if we replace computed with computed eager, we can see in our demo that this count over five will reevaluate when count changes, but our message will only be reevaluated when the value of is count over five changes. So if you're wondering when you would actually want to use eager computed, a solid rule of thumb is that if you have an expensive calculation inside your template, a computed property or a watcher that relies on a simple computed property that doesn't change values too often, like in our case, our is count over five, then we can use an eagerly computed value to reduce the number of times that our expensive operation runs. Once again, the default logic for computed is great for most of your apps, but I just thought that this was a little cool peek under the hood about how computed works. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video.